Good afternoon. It's about 1.20 and it's uh, Friday afternoon. And I hope you're all having a great day. It's kind of chilly over here um, in Arizona, over here in Surprise, Arizona. It's kind of overcast and it's only like 70 degrees and that's cold for me because anything um, below 80 and I'm freezing. I'm a true Arizona. I'm a true Zoni. So anyway, uh, today is a prayer of recommitment from the from the book of prayers to move your mountains. So anyway, the the scripture is Luke 12, uh, 15, 21 through 24. And the son said to him, Father, I have sinned against heaven and in your sight, and I'm no longer worthy to be called your son. But the father said to his servants, Bring out the best robe and put it on him, and put a ring on his hand and sandals on his feet, and bring the fatted calf here and kill it, and let us eat and be married. For this my son was dead and is alive again. He was lost and is found. And they began to be married. Heavenly Father, I come before you with a sober and humble heart. I have feasted upon your goodness, enjoyed your presence, and have yet and have and yet have ventured away from your from your protection and care father i have sinned against heaven and in your sight and i am no longer worthy to be called your child i have tested tasted the fruit of my sin and found it bitter and unsatisfying at this moment i rely solely upon your grace and mercy please forgive me for taking back the controls of my life and living as if you didn't exist if there was a way I could earn your reacceptance, I would do it. But your word tells me the sacrifices of God are a, broken, are a broken spirit, a broken and contrite heart. These, O God, you will not despise. So I come to you with a broken and contrite heart. Please cleanse me, renew me, and fill me once again. Take my heart of stone and transplant into me a heart of flesh. Breathe new life into my weary spirit so I will follow you and walk in your ways. You could have given up on me, but you didn't. Thank you for remaining faithful during my times of, of faithfulness. Like the father of, of, my, of, of my, during my times of faithlessness, I'm sorry. Thank you for the remain, remaining faithful during my times of faithlessness like the father of the prodigal son you waited for me yearning for my return and then when you saw me you came running rather than bring condemnation you have spared no expense to celebrate my return you put a robe on my back a ring on my hand and you have killed the fatted calf the only reason you take me back is because you love me with an everlasting love thank you for loving me when I didn't love you in return for wooing me back to the father's heart when i tried to ignore the conviction of your holy spirit in an attitude of repentance i renounce my ways i turn the opposite direction and choose once again to follow you i commit to developing relationships with people who love you to spend spending time with you to rem remaining connected in a local body and to sharing the good news of salvation with those around me Lord, you would rather that I be either hot or cold, but never lukewarm. Light your fire in me that I would be hot for you, so that all those around me would see the glory of your presence. In Jesus' name, amen. And that was the prayer of recommitment. And those, so if you're recommitting yourself to the Lord, pray that prayer. And uh, the scriptures used uh, in this prayer were Psalm 51, 17, Ezekiel 36, verse 26 to 27, 2 Timothy uh, chapter 2, verse 13, Luke chapter 15, 22 to 23, Jeremiah 31, 3, and Revelations chapter 3, verses 15 through 16. So I pray that if you're wandered away from the Lord and you want to come back to him, he's always has his door open. And so pray that prayer recommitment. God bless you today.